How do you feel like you've performed these first several weeks of the season? I feel like I've performed solid. Um, just taking my time, not trying to rush anything, not trying to force anything, just letting the game come to me. Uh, and I'm getting comfortable game by game. What was that experience out in Portland like for you? I mean, to play three high-level games in four days, get an understanding of the, I guess, the tolls this can take on you a little bit. Yeah, it was super fun playing against that great competition, uh, teams that you're going to see in the NCAA tournament and teams that are going to make runs. So that's going to make us better as a team. And me as an individual, just getting that early in the season, it's going to help me to develop. What's your relationship with Demarion like, given you're both true freshmen, you know, feeling your way early through the season? Yeah, we talk a lot just off the court. I mean, we're roommates, um, so we, we hang out all the time. So we talk about basketball, and then we don't talk about basketball. So uh, whenever we have questions, we, we can just ask each other, and we can learn from each other and learn from the older guys on the team. For you, have you been making more of a concerted effort to try and find opportunities to score than maybe you were earlier in the season? Or do you think that those are just things that are coming to you as a product of maybe how the season has gone to this point? Yeah, I'd say a little bit of both. Uh, I was a little hesitant the first couple of games, just trying to get the feel for it. And then once, once I got that, you know, it's just basketball. So I'm a pretty aggressive player. So I try to get downhill when I can. But I don't try to force anything. I just try to get in the paint. And then if my shot's there, it's there. If it's not, I pass it out. Are, I know you have a mentality of being a floor general, being a facilitator, and all those things. Are you the kind of guy that coach has to tell you to shoot the ball sometimes? Or you have to be willing to go and score? Yeah, that's you know? happened in my career a lot, um, just throughout AAU and high school. Uh, sometimes I pass a little too much. But at the same time, like. That's just who I am. That's how I play. So the shots are going to come, and then I'm going to dish it when I can. Damon, there's a, <clears throat> a video of you after last or the other game the other day, you signing autographs for young fans, clearly having an impact uh, this early on. What's that mean to you? Some of those fans maybe have watched you at Ames High in the previous years just to know that they're huge fans of you at such an early age for you. Yeah, it means a lot. Um, just being in their shoes when I was younger and just being able to be in this uh, great Coliseum and watch the, the great teams ahead of me play and just wanting to be out there. So I know what, what they're feeling. I know what they're uh, thinking when they watch the game. So I know if I was still in their shoes, I, I, I think it would be awesome if uh, any of the players would uh, talk to me or just give me an autograph. So I try to do whatever I can. You said you were in their shoes. Do you have memories of uh, a certain player you had signed something for you? Um, definitely, I think Monte's freshman year, I had a, a small basketball of that whole team. So DeAndre Kane and, and all those guys. So I think I still have that in my room at home. So uh, that's cool. I'll never forget about that.